Green Bee Gardeners. This is Jamie joining you from Green Bee Headquarters in Port St. Joe on this cloudy Friday afternoon. Earlier this week, Keelan and I went to Tallahassee and I purchased a few mature milkweed plants for a few of the bare spots that we have here in the colony. Now many of you know milkweed is the host plant for the monarch butterfly and its caterpillars. Uh, this is what the caterpillars like to eat and uh, also it is a great food for all other pollinators as well. Up here at the top, you can see that it's got a tiny beautiful gold flower. And down here about midway, you'll see that these bean shaped items are the seed pods. So I'll be collecting those seeds and scattering them, hopefully uh, growing some more milkweed. And these are rather mature milkweeds. Um, they stand about three feet tall, and I'm going to put them in two bare spots here in the pollinator garden. If you watched earlier episodes, you know that we planted uh, in-cap wildflower mix in this garden, as well as some marigold and alyssum boxes that we got at the dollar store. So I'm going to go ahead and plant these up, and. Uh, We'll come back in just a minute, but before we do, I want to share with you the newest addition to the pollinator garden. This is the Whirly Gig uh, that I purchased uh, around my birthday from Fo Frost Pottery. So for those of you who like garden art as much as I do, uh, definitely get to Frost Pottery in Mexico Beach and check out their Whirly Gig collection. Or if you live somewhere else, definitely uh, look for Whirly Gigs at your local nursery or of course online. I'll get planted and we'll check back with you in just a few moments. Welcome back, Green Bee Gardeners. It's the next day and as you can see, our milkweed got a great drink uh, from the rain that happened yesterday after we taped and early this morning. Um, and they're fitting quite nicely here in the pollinator garden. Don't forget to plant lots of food for your friends, the pollinators, and milkweed is a great way to do that. We hope you're planting this summer and having lots of fun wherever you are. Plant some seeds and save some bees, and we'll see you next time on Green Bee Gardener. Bye-bye!